Hello, everyone. Good afternoon, everyone. I hope you can hear us. If you can hear us, please mention a yes in the comments. If you can hear us, please mention a yes in the comments. Yes, Mamta, we are doing fine. Hi, Ashwini. Hi, Anusha. Hi, everyone. Hello, Mamta's Art Gallery. We are doing fine now. Thank you for asking. OK, so you guys can see Sam is back. You may ask, how was he? And yeah, thank you for your wishes. I'm doing perfectly fine now. So guys, let us know in the comment section if we are, uh, I mean, if you can hear us properly and we can move, eh? move on. Yes. Um, so we'll wait for a few more people and then we'll do the shout out. Sure, sure. That'll be yeah. better. It's not even four properly now. It's just four right now in a few seconds. So... Um, Hi, I Kajul. Hope. Hi, Surya. Hi, everyone. We can't take individual names and hence we are saying hi. Hi, Aisha. Hi, Danny. Hi, Guru Brahm, Brahman. Hi, Krishna. Yasmin. Ashwini. Jitendra Singh. Rani. Jaskreet. Hello, everyone. Oh, okay, they can hear us. Please move ahead. Yes, yes, Perfect, yes. perfect. So, um... Sir, ma'am, hello. Hello, everyone. Hello, English spoken. Hi, Niket. Hello, everyone. All right, perfect then. How are you, Sam, sir? I am doing pretty fine. Thank you for asking. Hi, cool dude. OK, perfect. perfect. So guys, uh, we have few shout outs right now. And mm -hmm. Sam is going to take the names. So please, wholeheartedly, we are thankful for these guys. Also, yes. uh, you guys show some support and say thank you for them. So yes. together And also, one more thing, you guys have sent a lot of videos. Uh, for why, which we asked, you know, that um, for your journey in English, we'll definitely make a video by tomorrow. Okay. You have sent us enough videos for uh, just a single video. Uh, so we'll make, create a video for you. Now, let me just shout Shivani 30 rupees. Thank you, Shivani. Krishna 101. Uh, Garima 100 rupees. Kamara 200 rupees. And Minakshi 100 rupees. Thank you all for the donation. You guys are doing great. Uh, we'll keep these classes going on. Um, because you guys are also doing charity. Thank you so much for that. Yes, um, Binisha, I think we have given you a website for that. So, um, you know, this is what uh, it's supposed to do. You need to find friends using the website, which is called uh, Conversation Exchange. Uh, just now, a few minutes ago, I think we got a new... Um, Donation. We'll discuss on that. Uh, Sunil, thank you uh, for that. I'm happy to see you here as well. Now, one more thing. Uh, we are not getting that many likes. It's 272 live people, and we have 63 likes only. We want more likes. Hi, uh, zero one from Sudan. Welcome to uh, the live stream from India. Uh, so, guys, we have received almost 500 emails so far uh, yes. requesting for that PDF. And I think some of the emails I'm receiving right now. So mm -hmm. those emails will be answered later. Rest, everything has been answered so far. Yes, exactly. So I hope you have received the PDFs. Mm -hmm. Did you like those PDFs? Just mention in the comment section. I mean, did you go through that? How was the experience? Did you like them or not? Uh, English spoken, we'll answer this question in a while. Just a second. Exactly, exactly. We'll answer the questions, all the questions in a while. Let us uh, just finish the shout outs and then we'll start the class properly. Yeah. So, hi, 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 hi. Hello, everyone. Uh, let's let's start the class. Okay. So today we have some uh, questions from Ash regarding. Um, hmm. So in the last class, uh, guys, we were discussing about prepositions. I think not many people were there, and even Sam wasn't there. Mm -hmm. So we were discussing about preposition, and you have given me tremendous, you know, lot of answers on that. So we have an exercise prepared for prepositions itself. Mm -hmm. And these questions are going to be tricky because, you know, these are little intermediate or advanced levels. So you have to think and then answer it properly. Okay. PDF is awesome. Now we're getting the answers thank for you, the PDF. Uh, yeah, thank you. Guys, they're, ask, uh, they're asking about your health. <laughs> I'm feeling fine. Goro, thank you for asking. This is pretty uh, good. You guys are really nice. Um, now let's start with the class. Yeah. So first question incoming. There you go. The first question. Keep it close to camera. You want to close it? Can you? I Just can try. Here is the question. 
you will receive the letter dash monday you will receive the letter dash monday let's start it guys answer it and give yourself 10 points if you are correct you will oh, okay. receive by monday by the monday. letter blank monday okay so first answer people think it's a let me show you again second time my god everybody is saying bye is okay. it correct so because everyone is saying should we say it's yes the correct answer uh and okay so yes the correct answer is by you will receive your letter by monday exactly the first answer is correct you by will monday. receive the letter by monday and i think most of them are giving the right answer, answer. Yes, so exactly. that's really awesome that's amazing you guys are doing great so we're going to go to the next one and yeah. uh, if you're wondering what is the reason for that so whenever you have to tell before something or in that time frame you will always say by monday yes you know you will not say on monday i mean that is another option which you can give but mm -hmm. in order to be more specific you can say you will receive your letter by monday so you can receive it on monday or you can receive it before monday exactly, as well exactly exactly okay so moving on we have our next question question sure go ahead i will see you the morning i will see you the dash morning i will see you dash the morning by morning by morning guys this is question number 2 no i'll see you later are they oh, they giving me answers okay now we are getting it again bye it's okay ah then there are answers it's tired right? let me do it for you i will see you blank the morning what is the answer for the second one okay now we are getting answers great 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 for the second one we are getting answers is in 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 perfect so uh, ash going to tell you the answer now please uh, show them the answer the answer so the is so the correct answer is correct in is the correct answer in is the correct answer i'll see you in the morning perfect Most I'll see you of you in correct. the morning. Correct. That's so amazing. the reason behind this is morning is a time period that starts from early morning four o'clock and it goes till eleven, eleven, twelve mm -hmm. before twelve. Yeah. So that time period starting from four o'clock till twelve noon, it's known as morning. So mm -hmm. it's a duration. That's why you say in the morning. Exactly. You don't say I will meet you on the morning. I'll meet you at the morning. That's wrong. You meet in the morning. Yeah. Okay. Um. Yeah, we have a donation of three hundred rupees, but I'm um incapable of seeing the name of the person. But thank you for that. There's a number involved. So, but I don't want uh, the number to be revealed. So, thank you three for three hundred rupees. You're doing great. Now, before we uh, continue with the preposition class, I would like to ask a question to all of you. Uh, please listen to this carefully. This is important for both of us. Our this is a now a new family, new community. You guys and us. So we are planning for a new channel. So what could this channel be? I'll give you options. The first thing is a craft channel. Second could be um, a food related channel and third could be a gaming related channel. All of them will be of course connected to English as well. So which channel that could be? A craft, food or gaming? So please let us know in the comments because uh, we want you to uh, see you in every phase we want to enjoy as well online. So please let us know should it be uh, craft related gaming related or food related so please write in the comments so that we understand what you really are looking for yes daisy i'm pretty fine now thank you priyanka thank you Okay, somebody has scored ten out of ten, twenty out of twenty. Yes, Rohit, we have a rapid textbook on on the back. He bought it. <laughs> He bought it. Okay, we have a lot of food, food, craft, gaming. That's good. <laughs> That's craft, an, food, gaming. Every quiz answer like. Okay, we have craft, food channel, food, craft. Uh, a lot of food request, craft or food. travel blog okay traveling is also one thing that's also good but for now covid you, you want us to go out now 
you want us to being seen you know behind the bars we don't want to do that okay um craft I think craft craft food gaming everything i think uh, now we are even more confused <laughs> <laughs> earlier we were thinking that we can ask so why don't why don't we combine yes. like you know a channel which has food craft gaming everything everything exactly we are planning that so that you can uh, yes food can be a good option that's right um if you want the pdf please write a mail to learn with samanash at the red gmail.com we will definitely so guys in order to remember our email addresses it's very simple learn with sam and ash is the channel name yes and then write at the red gmail.com yes um somebody saying food and fitness 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 can be a good option yeah veer says your dimple so <laughs> there is no videos on dimples <laughs> <laughs> Okay, okay um so thank you for um your feedback we'll definitely start something new soon because we are planning for that see uh either way you will also be uh, benefiting through this because we can talk about different aspects of life different uh, aspects of days uh, in different ways for example if it's craft channel you will know in english as well right if it is gaming you can disc- we play with us probably <laughs> if it is somebody saying a kind of please uh, uh support the food channel no other yes. things they want okay so we'll we'll try the food channel as, as well then don't um okay uh, vishal which book am i reading right now uh, can't see it can you pick that there is a book named as mein kampf uh, from hitler it's an i autobiography of mein kampf uh, of hitler wow. it's a huge book so we are reading right now yeah so that's the book i'm we actually i'm reading and he's reading the one which is there at the back again influence So there is a book named as Influence. Yeah. Gaming craft, food craft, food. <laughs> Now you'll get a lot of answers on that subject. Yes. Okay, Sony. Thank you for this uh, food thing. Life and productivity. Oh, that could be a good channel as Engineering well. Engineering com- combination. Combination. Perfect. Perfect. Gaming. Let it gaming, be everything. Please, everything. Craft. Perfect. So I. Uh, that. That. Thank you so much for this response. We will definitely start because we so, want everyone to enjoy. I think it's food, craft, travel. uh life related videos gaming um, yes so i think everything in short you want from us right so <laughs> <laughs> uh we'll definitely do that yeah that's what is inside all of them okay wonderful that's wonderful. that's thank a cool you for idea. the response um now we can go back to the next uh, question in preposition uh, ash can go th- on that and i'll ask you another question in the coming time right so food and beauty can't do that <laughs> <laughs> okay the pdf is good thank Excellent. you this is this is the next in time yeah third question can you okay we have the next question here uh yes we'll discuss uh, binisha about the website definitely related to conversation here it is i mean this is the next question though okay so next question is this one Can you see it? Will you be home blank time for dinner? Will you be home blank time for dinner? Uh can you guys see that? Okay. Okay, we are getting answers now at in at in Okay, okay. all right at 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 in at c all right so um there we go uh, ash can review the answer so uh, the people who have mentioned a okay <laughs> <laughs> so i thought you were saying something the answer is a in exactly. time in time and uh, can you explain them why so do you think it's in the reason is will you be home in time for dinner whenever there is a duration or some uh, not exactly duration i would say you are giving a uh, a definite uh, like this is the time we start dinner mm-hmm. uh, from 8 o'clock to 9 we have dinner starting point yeah. yeah so whenever you want to you want to ask somebody that will you be in time for dinner so that means will you be on Punctual. time from 8 to 9 o'clock somewhere in the middle so we have a shout out for kanaya for 40 rupees uh, kanaya ponya thank you for 40 rupees in super chat kanaya uh, do you have a question a special regard for you if you have question you can ask us <laughs> Yes you can ask uh, a question Kanaya Ponya will definitely reply on that 
Okay. So as I was saying, whenever there is a duration from eight to nine, the dinner time starts from eight and still nine. You want to ask somebody, will you be in time? That means, will you be between eight to nine? Yes. That's how you use this preposition. Yes, Mamta. It's in time. That's correct. Um, so Moving on, we have fourth question. The painting. Before, um, sorry. Can okay. Just, okay. okay. Um, we have um, 10 rupees from um, Surojit Murmu and... Uh, 300 rupees from uh, Bhanu Priya. Thank you so much for the donation. By the way, I got the names finally because my app wasn't opening. Now it's working. Uh, Suroji, 10 rupees. Bhanu Priya, 300 rupees. And Super Chair from Kanaya Ponya uh, for 40 rupees. Thank you so much, guys. You're doing great job. Okay. Uh, we also need a shout out. I forgot yesterday. A shout out for Rajiv. Um, Muskan and uh, Sunny, thank you for um, donating 100 rupees each. That's really awesome. That's really awesome. All right, so we're going to go for the next one. So the painting is dash the ceiling. The painting is dash the ceiling. Yes. Guys, let's focus on question number fourth. Wow, I'm correct. Yes, Segal, <laughs> you are correct. Uh, for PDFs, we again mentioned that learn with Sam and Ash at the rate gmail.com. Aistana. Sam, you're looking you're so, so cute. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the praising. And uh, let's answer this question. Okay, first. so we have got a lot of answers on at by. Let's see with, what is the correct answer for this. Okay. The painting is on the ceiling. Exactly. The painting is on the ceiling. And why so? So, guys, whenever I, as we told, we discussed earlier as well, whenever two surfaces are touching each other, it has to be on. Mm -hmm. So, if you put a painting there on the wall like this, the painting is touching the wall. And hence, it's the painting is on the wall. Mm -hmm. In this case, you are talking about ceiling. So, the painting painting cannot be on the ceiling. Sorry, there is a mistake here. But no, it's logically incorrect. The fan is on the ceiling. That's exactly. correct. Yes. Ceiling is roof. So the fan is on off, on the ceiling. The painting is on the wall. Yeah. That's how we do it. Okay. So before we go to the next question, I have another question not connected to English, but connected to something else. I actually have two questions. First question is, we have 400 people and 182 likes. Why so? Okay. <laughs> this shows that we have to stop the class yes, right now. Yes, uh, 400 people, 182 like, not good. Second question is, what do you like, guys? Coffee or tea? What kind of people you are? Coffee or tea people? Please mention in the comments. Okay. What do you like? This is just, just, just for fun for one minute so that you can uh, concentrate again on English. Are you a coffee person or a tea person? Coffee person is a person who just likes coffee. And tea person is a person who likes tea. And there's last one category, opportunities. You know, whatever <laughs> they get, whatever, whatever they can get, uh, yeah, likes kind likes are increasing thank you guys whatever they can get they'll drink so are you the opportunist coffee people or a coffee person or tea person akansha what happened to you seriously what happened okay so guys you have a new word here opportunist yes opportunist is, is someone who grab everything and anything so yeah, as person... you said uh, coffee tea together that's an opportunist <laughs> Okay, we're getting the answers now. Coffee, mil mil milk was an option too. Yeah, that's fine. Whatever you drink, coffee, coffee, tea. Vodka. <laughs> cool, dude. That's not allowed here and you shouldn't. It's not good for health, okay? This is just a suggestion. So, tea, tea coffee, coffee tea, tea, coffee. I think the, the votes for coffee chai. is more. Chai, Prasant is also tea. That's the thing, yeah? It, it's fine. Both. Chai is, is a good word though. You know, it's used in uh, UK as well. It's called chai tea. chai tea. So when they add milk to the tea, they call it chai tea. By the way, new new words for you. Coffee, 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 tea, milk. Uh, we'll answer the questions later. A green tea. No, oh, for the first you time. You like it. <laughs> I can assure you that. <laughs> okay. I think uh, so we can reveal our things. Now, uh, we love coffee. Definitely. We are coffee people. Recently, I mean, I turned to be a coffee person recently, like 10 days. Mm -hmm. Earlier, I used to have coffee, but I was an opportunist uh, back then. So, so Kansa said that she is hardcore tea lover. We have hardcore tea lovers as well, right? Perfect. perfect. So you can see we are hardcore coffee lovers uh, <laughs> in a way. So everyone in my house is tea lover. And we, I personally like black coffee. Yeah. 
and he's in a bot and it is in coffee <laughs> his mug has something <laughs> i i still have coffee all right so we'll go back to our uh, questions yeah sure perfect perfect so we have there is a shop um, the fifth one <laughs> there you go there you go next one there is a shop blank the comer of the street corner of the street i'm sorry there is a shop blank the corner of the street there is a shop blank the corner of the street somebody says they are opportunists wonderful <laughs> somebody, somebody said, said i like warm water <laughs> Anything yeah. can be found. Turmeric, milk, lot of. <laughs> <laughs> you don't like these stuff. <laughs> and somebody says cutting chai. That's amazing. Cutting chai, green tea, royal star. <laughs> <laughs> Always depends on what you feel uh, to love. Priya says nothing, dude. <laughs> All right, th there we go. We, we have a question now. Yeah. So let's discuss this one. Don't drink both. They are not good <laughs> for your health. Okay, we're getting answers now. Okay, perfect. At 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 in in at. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh perfect, my God! So perfect. many answers. Good. Keep going. I think we are getting our previous um, likes back, but still we need more, little bit more. Okay. Uh, by the way, uh, okay. Now um, Ash can reveal the answer and also explain the answer. So, guys, the answer for this is there is a shop. at the corner of the street mm -hmm. so i think you are aware of this answer because in the last class we discussed about whenever you have a specific point you say at now there comes a question in this part we mention the shop is at the corner of the street so for example this is a street and in this point you have a shop so you say at the corner now imagine you're talking about a room and there is a corner in the room so every room has four corner like the one you can see at the back yeah. that's a corner too in this case you will say the library is in the corner because now we are talking about boundary mm -hmm. so whenever you are talking about a room or a closed surface you say in and whenever you are talking about a specific point and there is no boundary you will say at exactly exactly good great okay so we're going to go to the next one or we should discuss something else Sure, ask sure. him ask him <laughs> okay should we go to the next question or should we discuss something else uh, regarding english it's your choice you take the vote and we go to the next question or we discuss something else also you can write your questions now if you have any question in mind you can go with that so you are such a great person thank you so much for your uh, compliment Please let me explain i forgot that question got ma'am you are so sweet somebody says uh sham says mummy you are so sweet okay great uh thank you guys and uh, girls you guys are also nice cutting chai for you <laughs> uh rajiv is uh, rajiv is confused can you explain okay, this to I'll rajiv i'll explain it again so guys rule number 1 is whenever we are talking about a room mm -hmm. or a boundary mm -hmm. and in the boundary you have a corner can you guys see this wall at the back mm -hmm. so there is a corner there so i can say i'm standing in the corner of the room in that case you will talk about in now imagine you are talking about an open road and there is a cross road like two roads are uh, passing through each other and there is a shop there we call it a nukkad wala shop yeah we have a nukkad shop so <laughs> at that point you say at the corner exactly because you don't have a close boundary so you say i'm standing at the corner in this case you talk about i'm standing in the corner All right, we have a shout out for Munali Patil. Munali Patil, thank you for fifty rupees. You are doing great. Thank, thank you, you so Munali. much, guys. Thank, thank you, you so much. Thank you, Munali, for fifty rupees. I think we have crossed the ten ten thousand. Uh, more than that. More than that. Thank you so much for the donation. This will going to help for people who cannot earn for every day. So, guys, after okay? this class, I think we either today or tomorrow we'll calculate everything and, and we'll, we'll let, let you know, know how much how received. much we have done so far okay? with your help. Ah, okay, we are getting the answers for something else previously. Something else. Next one. Something else. Next one. Next so, question. Next, next question. Okay, sure. We're going to the, go <laughs> for the next question. Like next question. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll go for the next question then. Okay, we'll there's a question. What is the difference between begin and write? Begin and start. Sorry. Begin and start. I think they are synonyms. First of all. In a way, yes. Yes, and um, both can be used as noun as well as verbs. So you can say, uh, let's begin. so that's oh okay word. begin is actually you can be used as a verb start can be used as noun, noun. as well as verb both 
That's you say, maybe the difference. Let's start from the beginning. Yes. So there's a way to say that. Yeah. So start could be an action and mm. begin could be... Um, is it we are beginning, right? That's a, that's a noun, actually. That's a noun. Yeah. We are beginning, or number two, shall we start? Yes. So that's used as a verb in a way. Yeah. So yeah. It, it is used as interchangeable. Interchangeable. They are yeah. synonyms in a way. Synonyms, yeah. Okay, so we have more questions, I think. Uh, mm. What is the meaning of supposed to? Supposed to means um, kind of you were obliged to do it. You were asked to do it, but uh, yeah. you didn't do it. In most cases, for example, I was... I suppose I was supposed to come to the live class, but I couldn't. That means I uh, thought of doing it, but I couldn't. Okay. Uh, Somebody is asking, well, how can we use prepositions perfectly? So, guys, uh, let me tell you something. Preposition is the most confused topic of English grammar. True. You can never be 100% right in this. So, the <laughs> best way to use preposition perfectly is to you know, keep educating yourself about them. Mm -hmm. So whenever you read a sentence, whenever you read an article or you find usage of preposition anywhere, mm -hmm. take a moment and think, do you understand that? Or what is the rule that they have applied? And also as you know, so far, even till date, I and Sam personally use these books as we have told in the comment sections as well. Uh, sorry, not the comment. In the suggested books for English grammar. So this is Raymond's Murphy English grammar. Mm -hmm. And I uh, I mean, I'm not sure about him because his grammar is pretty fine. But I get confused most of the time. And hence, I refer these books. So that's the best way you can actually enhance your uh, preposition. Keep reading. Keep educating yourself. We have a message from uh, uh, Segal. I didn't get your question. Can you please write it again? We got a message from people about your praising. Um, you're welcome, Kanea Ponya. All right. Uh, so we have next person. Uh, okay. We have next question now. Okay. So next question coming. We'll discuss the question. Don't worry. Please uh, listen to this. Uh, Akansha will discuss have had. Okay. We'll discuss have had in a while. Have had is the next question, guys. Have had is the next question from Akansha. I didn't see you dash at the party. I didn't see you dash at the party. I just gave the answer. No, you didn't. I did. <laughs> You did? I kind of revealed the answer. Let's see if you have noticed it. I didn't see you the party. <laughs> Aniket, have had is the next question we're going to discuss. Don't worry about it. What is the exact meaning of kind of? That's another question. Kind of. And we have a question regarding interview skills. So, And I what think... is your language, sir? I didn't see dash the party. Let me get the answers now. Yes. Shweta book name is Raymond Murphy. Um, there's a donation just just came. Okay, thank you, Monish, for hundred rupees in super chat. Thank you, Monish. That's so nice of you. Okay, Monish. Um, Mohini, it... sorry, I'm sorry, Mohinish Ahuja. Thank you for hundred rupees for uh, mentioning good job. Thank jobs. you, Monish. Thank you so much. Okay. Okay, so the book name was Raymond Murphy. Raymond Murphy. Yeah, English Grammar by Raymond Murphy. And three volumes. There yes. are three volumes. So as we were discussing, guys, I didn't see you dash the party. And I gave the answer of this. Let me note. <laughs> I noticed that. See, yeah, somebody did. says that I noticed that. Okay. I didn't see you dash the party. I didn't see you in the party, at the party. It's... On the party, let's see. So now, chocolates. Rahul always gives us a lot of chocolates. Rahul from day one. Yeah, he wants us to get sugar. So. <laughs> okay, so the okay, answer the is. The answer is here. The answer is not visible, Sam. Uh, up, up, yeah. Okay, answer is here. At the party. Okay, answer is at the party, not in the party. Um, because in is, I think, used for things where it is close from all the surfaces. In a way, yes. Uh, so I didn't see you in the me. I didn't see you at the meeting. I didn't see you at the party. Exactly. Whenever you have event, yes. remember the rule is whenever you're talking about any event, you mm -hmm. will always use at. Mm -hmm. If it's anything other than event, you will use in. For okay. example, meet me in the class. So class is a a, a room. It's not an event. So exactly. you will say I'll meet you in the class. Perfect explanation. Thank you. All right. So. Uh, Something I'm going to discuss is very important for, um, I just want to ask you a question. Has there been a time when you are feeling down that you don't want to learn anything new? Okay. A question which could uh, maybe touch many souls, but also uh, it has happened to me. But has there been a time when you felt that you don't want to learn anything? 
and that could be now i understand you might not get the motivation to just get out of the bed and start learning anything new so let us know in the comments there has been a, if there's an has been a time where you don't want to learn anything new how your journey of learn, learning english from beginners to advanced please explain we'll do that just uh, in a while let me get the name first anshul we'll discuss that so guys uh, sam just asked the question that did you feel that you are not motivated enough to learn yes. something uh, do you feel like lose you know you, you lost, lost something it? or let's say you don't want to just learn anything you know uh, there has might be the time you are bored with everything and you're exactly. not getting the right motivation to do something exactly so has there been the time if there has been please mention in the yes we'll discuss the introduction as talker for sure yeah <laughs> pubg ka huh pubg uh, somebody asking when you going to play pubg <laughs> <laughs> he uh, i am not a gamer at all but he loves to play counter strike plan zombies doom <laughs> doom. doom i love to play doom yes killing monsters yes definitely yes very often we yeah. are getting answers now um pubg khelo na pubg khelna nahi aata <laughs> <laughs> i don't play pubg i'm sorry sometimes i play uh, cs and doom okay so we're getting answers okay. yes yes and no yes um see the main reason for you to not learning anything new is there's no hope for in your mind for tomorrow so don't think of the bigger picture that's my suggestion okay don't think of like i'll create something big i'll create something which can change the world just make one day a good day that's it think of just the next day and today that that will be enough right so if you have the motivation to get out of your bed right um that would be enough trust me and that i have learned so far so guys uh, just to add to that story uh, the channel that we are actually able to connect with you guys mm -hmm. was not created in one day true how many channels did we fail i we think failed four four channels for in my uh, remembrance more than that for you <laughs> so guys as he said we never thought that we'll be able to create a youtube channel which will have 3.5 lakh subscribers some day that was never our you know uh, a Thinking hope we, or yeah. we never dreamt of it but we applied one thing that let's start from one step at a time let's think of tomorrow if we are able to get 10 more subscribers tomorrow that will be more than sufficient exactly. so that's very true don't think of the bigger picture that one day i'll be a fluent speaker think of tomorrow that tomorrow i might be little better than what i'm today i might be able to learn few rules and new vocabulary words for tomorrow yes uh, so if you are depressed that could be uh, one thing that you don't want to do anything okay i just want uh, uh, i want to just shout out to everyone who is right now learning who is right now trying that's a great thing you're doing everyone shall we are not ignoring your question uh, we shall we have mentioned everything here so we'll answer the question prashan but... is spreading some rumors here <laughs> we are not ignoring anyone guys um yes you can get uh, the email id is learn with sam and ash at the gmail.com please write mails that's our there. channel name learn with sam, sam and, and ash, ash. at the gmail.com exactly yeah uh, and please keep your uh, keep the donation coming from your friends uh, and keep the likes up okay uh, sorry we don't play pubg we do play cs and sometimes doom that i do play right <laughs> so uh, in the future we might make videos on that for fun okay so um yeah we're going to well let's answer this have and had um so okay have had i mean together and separately a both auxiliary as well as main verbs see remember in tenses all you need to um understand is what is the main verb what is the auxiliary verb you understand that okay so main verb could be the verb which is uh, kind of giving the meaning to the sentence and the auxiliary verb tells us about the time and duration sometime so here if i say i have a pen it's not the auxiliary verb it's the I, main I'm verb i'm really sorry to stop you gotham has made such an awesome point here rome was not built in a day true 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 that's he a, said rome was not built in a day that is so quote. true yeah. true nice okay. proverb so uh, when you have any sentence please figure out if it is an auxiliary verb or a main verb so i have a pen is have is a main verb I have had discussed this before um, seven o'clock. So I have had here. One of them is the main verb. One of them is an auxiliary verb. Now, 
based on a situation you create such sentences had is used is for perfect tense past perfect tense or something which you had in past another meaning okay so please understand or research more on this we have already made videos on grammar but still we're going to make more but now understand that search or let's say google search on have as main verb and auxiliary verb had as main verb and auxiliary verb and have had together you will definitely find a lot of answers on that thangam nobody is ignoring you don't worry we can answer um can you talk about introduction uh, in sure. a job interview we we'll do that there's another question which i really liked uh, somebody asked what is the meaning of indeed Indeed. Somebody asked, "What is the difference between located and situated?" situated. Yes, uh, I think that was S. Thakur. S. Yeah. Thakur was asking, "Located and situated." Located is kind of talking using the word location in uh, reference, and then I, in in my sense, they are both interchangeable. Exactly, they can be used, you know, interchangeably. Like I said, they both mean the same thing. So um, we are situated in Bangalore, and yeah, Bangalore this, is located in Karnataka. Yeah, the same thing. indeed is kind of uh, saying positive yes somebody said something and we said yes for that so instead of simple yes you can say indeed exactly. for example the weather is amazing today indeed it is indeed it is instead of saying yes it is we say indeed it is um so that is the meaning and finally you can dis discuss about um, introduction in a job interview so we have a video right s thakur okay s thakur this is the answer for your question mm -hmm. how to introduce yourself in um, in an interview so let me tell you something guys which not many of you know uh, i was i worked as an hr as well uh, back in my career some days so one thing that i felt most of the you know interviewers or panelists look for is a genuine response true this question is most of the time asked to understand something about you in just 2 minutes mm. they cannot remember every information that they, you give them so uh, arun thank you for 40 rupees we'll just do a shout out again let me complete Why this grammar response grammar is not important as a beginner okay. okay so the object the objective behind this question in interview is to understand about you in just 2 minutes not more than that you don't have much time there so what i personally suggest i have made an elaborative video on that you can always refer to but if i have to we'll give you one tip over here always remember start with your name always say uh, like you know my name and in fact it's not required most of the time because they already know your name so you can say thank you for the opportunity and let me tell you something about myself so this is a sample answer guys please focus so thank you for giving me the opportunity and let me tell you something about myself i come from a farming background and uh, i did my schooling from this in this school mm -hmm. and i graduated in 2016 from this college i worked as a polymer engineer for some time then i thought to change my career and i became an hr something like that yeah and then you can say uh one thing that you will like to know about me is that i love reading books and i am an emotional person so i get stressed out really quick enough more than sufficient you don't have to add anything else in this introduction if they ask you more you know tell me about the last project tell me about the work tell me about your college projects then you can always add more information yes true um now the question for arun arun as and also donated 40 rupees thank you arun why grammar is not important as a beginner that's a very good question and uh, i would say yes that's right grammar is not that important for the beginner because see if you start learning anything new and if you're not interested what's going to happen you run away from that right you'll get bored eventually get bored. yeah and once you get bored there is no force in the world not even us who can make you learn english or anything if you get bored by something there is no chance in the world that you're going to learn it second thing grammar are rules they are for references they are not to be remembered if you are speaking anything you're not thinking of grammar think about in your native language you don't think of grammar while speaking what do you think of are sentences words and situation and to try to make someone understand see when you don't know english what do you say here there this that water people understand that so start with that start pe understanding pe making people understand and also understand their english copy them so initially grammar is not important once you go little bit higher level above intermediate you need to know all the rules you want to be correct at that time you need grammar so initially if you're learning please don't focus just on grammar focus on understanding things right
focus on communication that's uh, our suggestion uh so there's a question is there any alternative to reading books yes there is not everybody is interested in reading books so mm -hmm. we don't force you to read books if you are not interested in in that place you can always start with watching movies perfect shivam so, saini welcome to the first class this is your first class welcome to the class okay so while sam was talking i got a couple of questions mm -hmm. what is the a complete name of raymond murphy's book so that will go in the description because every book has a different a uh, front page will give that in the description uh, yeah. uh, navjot as it gets me angry and he makes gets me angry. he makes me angry what is the difference so he makes me angry is when you are actually fighting with someone and you are irritated or frustrated by an activity you can say he makes me angry so you are specifying to a person he makes me angry it gets me angry actually it's incorrect most probably N uh, or maybe you are talking about weather gets on nerve Gets he gets on, on my nerve could yeah. be one thing he gets on my nerve is a phrase to show that he makes me angry are you Same talking thing. about weather weather gets me angry yeah that could be one thing yeah. weather, get, weather gets me angry like this this situation gets me angry in that case you say it gets me angry if you're talking about human beings or yeah. situation uh, i mean human beings in particular you True. say he makes me angry so instead of um um we have uh, from kusum lata char 200 rupees um Thank you so much and for Sumbhata. Thank uh, you. Thank you so much for two hundred rupees donation. That's amazing. Uh, you are doing pretty uh, good for the donation. I I love to clap for this. Thank you so Thank much, you guys. Thank you so much. Okay, uh, we're gonna proceed and um, see. Okay, we have more questions. I think we can uh, <laughs> we can work on the questions later. We gonna uh, do the questions now. We have now. three more questions in three the exercise. Three more questions, and we have twenty minutes remaining. So I think not twenty, even nineteen now. Let's start with this, okay? Yeah, that's seventh question. There you go. Answer these questions, please. There are too many people blank the bus. There are too many people blank the bus. There are too many people blank the bus. Okay. in 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 at at on perfect so you are getting answers now and guys in your mind think about the reason why are you saying in at and on <laughs> yes think of the reason as well here yeah. so uh you got to get the answer as well let's see the answer so the answer is on the bus Exactly. Now I'm I'm sure you are gonna get pissed, <laughs> ma'am. Why proposition keeps on changing? Yes. Why is this getting you on nerve, <laughs> making you angry? It's yes. getting you angry now. I know this is getting. So can you please explain? Yeah. So guys, the answer is uh, there are too many people on the bus. Yes. Now the rule is simple. You just have to learn it. Whenever you are talking about heavy vehicles, like bus, trucks, trains. Aeroplanes, ships. You will always say, "I'm traveling on." On. I'm traveling on the bus. I'm traveling on the ship. I'm traveling on the plane. I'm traveling on the trucks. Yes. Whenever it's heavy vehicle, you will always use on. Whenever you're talking about smaller things, like you know, not very smaller, but covered objects like um, cars, taxis, mm -hmm. you will always use in. Now, when you're talking about motorcycles, mopeds, cycles, you will always say. on again okay so, so i'm on the bicycle i'm on the bike i hope the explanation was enough it cannot be in the bus because the vehicle is huge if the vehicle is huge you have to say on if the vehicle is small you say in and if the vehicle is motorbike you say on as well i hope it is clear precise and direct okay perfect we go to next one and i think you've already answered this again <laughs> she arrived blank. dash a taxi yeah she arrived blank a taxi vicky the correct answer is on the bus for the previous question so let's see she arrived dash a taxi i know that you're confused with the boundaries <laughs> <laughs> guys see i told you initially prepositions are really confusing more you learn more the more you use the more you learn so that's yeah. the rule True. here Okay, let me hear the answer for this one. She arrived dash a taxi. Wrong, हो गया. कोई बात नहीं. 
everyone wrong they said that wiki said that. <laughs> uh, we have next question she arrived blank a taxi s thakur welcome to the channel heavy vehicles on correct on the boat correct because bus is moving that is also another explanation for this exactly but car also moves so intuition somebody is asking the meaning okay intuition means uh, gut feeling gut feeling exactly when you feel from inside to sixth do something sense. your sixth sense is your intuition she arrived blank a taxi and the correct correct answer is she arrived in a taxi okay so as i was saying it's a small vehicle and hence you say in a taxi not a bus not a truck not a ship not a plane that's correct why. okay uh, ninth question after that we'll keep one question for the end just ninth question we are showing you you can you pay me dash blank. check you can play me blank check you can pay me blank check yeah <laughs> blank check <laughs> you can pay me a blank space and check <laughs> we feel like answering it while asking the question that's funny <laughs> yeah because that makes sense right together <laughs> okay okay mhm mm by check by 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 in on there is an option on no yes. no this is previous answer i feel yeah is it let's discuss something about english literature <laughs> name you remember the name um, okay guys so the question was you can pay me dash check and the correct answer is so before that let me just shout out for gorov uh, you can discuss let's discuss something about english literature definitely gorov joshi we will discuss on that <laughs> in a while after this question okay so gaurav please don't feel that because of the donation we are answering a question i i read this question before but since there are a lot of questions we couldn't answer now you highlighted right. yourself in a way <laughs> okay so the correct answer is you can pay me by check yes you can pay me by check yes true now whenever you have a medium to do something you always use by hmm. but there is another thing you can pay me in cash So, in cash yeah cash is check. an exception only for cash you say in rest everywhere you can say buy by check. like buy check by credit cards by debit True. cards uh, you can uh, withdraw some money by atm yes um now i have i have um because we have finished the question yeah. last one more remaining last one mm. we'll discuss that in the end i have a challenge for you guys we keep giving challenges and we love that and i hope you love them as well now the challenge is we are not getting more than 500 live people you know concurrent viewers we get 400 480 490 is it possible to make it 1000 concurrent viewers ask your friends ask your family to log in and watch and log in from different mobile phones <laughs> no log same. in from different people you know ask them to watch not about mobile phones it, this is for a comment if you think we are doing commendable jobs we want a favor from you let's make it 1000 viewers in a go if it's possible please help us so you want to do it right now or you asking them uh, for tomorrow? tomorrow tomorrow probably because right now it's already just 10 minutes left and the person who will join so guys, now tomorrow grab a hand of someone and ask them to sit right yes, there <laughs> because that will be helpful for them and also they will be doing something good so is it acceptable that you can help us through this that you can make it Thousand people in a go. So the challenge is thousand people, thousand likes. Yes, that's it. That would be great, and we will make our best. Tomorrow we have a lot of exercises coming, not just blanks. You have audio exercises coming tomorrow. Okay, I make sure that tomorrow's class is ten times more interesting. This is also fun, I know, but we will have something more than just blanks. English, English ki class ke liye morning gyara baje aayega kal. Uh, Bharat, hello Bharat. uh joshi harad bharat joshi we already uh, have um yeah, arti is angry <laughs> arti is very angry i don't know why arti got angry and suddenly there's a uh, cherry <laughs> <laughs> so might be she sending to uh, kamal is asking something ma'am can i ask you something please Definitely. go ahead kamal please go ahead take me as 100 oh my god <laughs> yes we'll take you as 100 but we need 100 then concurrent viewers over there Perfect, so guys, perfect, perfect. It, it won't be easy to complete this challenge. Just one person, you, everyone. That's it. That's what we are asking you. Yes. If it's possible, we just want another person with you so that they learn. It's not just because we want <laughs> thousand. Gagan Devi is saying, "Don't think for bigger." <laughs> <laughs>
one yes, million Chahat, will be live soon. Uh, Chavla, definitely, we, maybe one day one million live. Probably that will be world record if I'm not wrong. Yeah. Maybe we can target ah. that. Yeah. <laughs> let's, let's hope for that. That's a bigger picture. Okay. okay. So. Uh, the last question? Yeah. Perfect. The door must be opened dash a key. The door must be open dash a key. Um, before that, I would like to say a big thank to Sirisa, uh, Sri Risha, sorry, Sri Risha for 300 rupees donation. Amazing job. Thank Sri you, Risha, Sri Risha. Thank, thank you, you so much. Thank you, Sri Risha for 300 rupees. That's great. Thank you so much. So guys, before I answer this, I remember something from one of our life classes in Hindi. We mm -hmm. had one and a half life class, if I'm not wrong. In that Shakil, happy birthday to you. Shakil, happy birthday. So in that life class, there's this guy, Jaskrit. I remember his name because his question was very interesting. He said, Aapka Hindi accent to samaj aagya. Sam sir ka Hindi accent to na. <laughs> so they wanted to hear Sam speaking in Hindi. One day. <laughs> someday. <laughs> Not someday. Actually, I can uh, I can try once we get 1,000 viewers live. That's a challenge, and definitely I'll try to speak in Hindi. Yeah. So, guys, that'll be the the exciting thing in that particular class. I can yes. guarantee you that. Okay. Okay. So, I'll repeat the question again. And then we'll give you the answer. The door must be open. Dash a key. You are ignoring me. No, we are not. Nobody is ignoring you. It's just a lot of questions. Okay, we're getting answers with by with by. So the correct answer is the door must be opened with a key. Exactly. The door must be opened with a key. We cannot ignore you. If we ignore you, the live stream is over, you know. Yeah. So we cannot ignore you. You are customers. <laughs> <laughs> no, so we, guys, this is community. Uh, this is family. The 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 answer is the with door the must be open with a key. Sarv says with 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 exactly. Sarv Sandhu. With, with, with. <laughs> so the reason behind that is whenever you use something to do something, you use with. Exactly. I use uh, I use a key to open the door and hence you can say I open the door with a key. Mm. So instead of writing I use a key to open the door, you can say I open the door with a key. True. Remember it whenever you are using something to do something you use with and whenever you do directly, I write by pen. In that um, case you use by. Sanjay Srivastava, thank you for your donation. We probably didn't get the name properly. Uh, there must be some error. Sanjay Srivastava, thank you for your donation. Uh, we appreciate your effort. Again. So, guys, we, we want to say that if we have missed anybody's name, please, please write take us. a thank you from us in advance and um, notify us. You can us. write us on WhatsApp yeah. or on the app. We'll definitely do a shout out. If Let us know it. if we have missed it. We are extremely sorry for that. Hi, Krish. Krish, Krish, um, Krish I said. Thank if you. If you want to pay, you can just uh, send us money using either uh, Google Pay or uh, Phone Pay on this number 974395283. This is the number. Somebody's Nine seven four three nine five two five eight three. Somebody is saying that seriously, you can't speak in Hindi. He can, but that's funny. You should listen to that. <laughs> so tomorrow we'll see if we get thousand. We'll definitely do that. Yeah. Oh my God, this is interesting. Four seventy two people, four seventy seven likes. Perfect. That's what to what we want to see, and uh, I think our goal is being achieved. Now we're gonna discuss some questions. So please. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Don't challenge us because Shahad we love Shahad you Shahad. and we'll take it to 1 million subscribers. That's Perfect. awesome. Thank you for that. That's and awesome. on 1 million subscribers, I am going to send 10 books to some of our subscribers, lucky subscribers, 10 grammar books. On 1 million, in fact, we can make it 100 as well. No, we should do that when we have 5, five lakhs. Yes, we can do that. 10 books for uh, some lucky subscribers. And you have the, the condition is you have to like, comment and subscribe as well. So, so we'll send you 10 books. And as soon as we hit 1 million subscribers, we'll be sending you 100 people grammar books. Correct. Okay. So this is from me, uh, from us as uh, Learn with Sam and Ash. We'll definitely send you books. See, this is the most important part as a community. We grow, and you grow. I'm not, I'm not sure if it's right to say that. Autographed. Yes, yeah, so <laughs> we'll, we'll write a note from our end to you guys in exactly, that. Exactly, exactly, exactly. We'll do that. We'll do that. Okay, uh, last question about regarding the channel which we're going to start. Uh, do you also want a, just a channel just where we talk in English? There's nothing involved. Okay? Do you want a channel where we just talk about everyday life, about everyday problems, relationships, family, anything? If you want such channel, please mention... Uh, 
Hello, uh, Thangam says. Say Ashwin, hi, sister. I'm very active. Somebody. <laughs> I'm always active. If you say nice things, I'll be active. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, uh, do you want a channel where we can? Um, Raghav, nobody is ignoring you. Can you uh, can you please mention the thing now? So it's a special hi to Raghav. Nobody yeah, is ignoring you. Yeah, hi to Raghav. Having said that, is used um, when you finish saying something and uh, you want to say something else. or related to it like for example like i said uh that's uh, the stream is going great having said that uh we we'll are in the class yeah we'll end the <laughs> class so that is having said that when you say something and then you add it perfect we have 460 or 470 viewers and 500 likes wonderful that's going great um uh, yes sega will we'll definitely count you in um at 5 lakh subscribers 10 so books. guys they're going to be a uh, a challenge before that book thing mm -hmm. so that you know everybody gets a fair chance we, we don't want to miss anyone yeah uh, gokulam uh, pg prasad reddy 520 rupees if i'm mispronouncing your name i'm sorry uh, but uh, we have gokulam 20 rupees thank you so much for the donation thank you so much um perfect perfect uh, we are all yes we love mm -hmm. you all and uh, 9743952583 yes that's the number Hello Prerna guys uh, we have uh, hindi sessions in the morning mm -hmm. we learn english through hindi where i come nowadays but he'll be joining in coming days if you want to hear his hindi accent there so uh, 11 o'clock it is every day 4 o'clock is the english session with all cases iphone or android i don't want to ask this question there will be a war because of iphone and android i don't okay, want to do let that let us let us show you show you something uh, because this is see we promote both <laughs> we are fine with both we have iphone and android both so we, we don't want to uh, fight on that yeah um okay so uh, you guys are saying fine for a channel where we just stand oh, and talk answers? in english where um, we just discuss everyday life problems like a family so it's going to be a channel or a playlist um could be a new channel okay. just where talk with sam and ash could be something right so that's interesting <laughs> okay we can do that hi uh, ali hi there hi kevin um let us know why so like your class in both of you hi uh, lakshmi's daughter uh we paused the 30 days challenge because in covid we are trying to help the people who are in need for this live class we'll definitely try our best to create a video on 30 day challenge it's so, not so this video is coming now or the one we received lot of videos for yes so that's so going to be so the video that uh, you have sent us your videos will definitely send you guys so, uh, i mean create a video on that so that you are all the time on our channel okay you will see yourself on our channel um yes thangam will say bye to you don't worry about that definitely uh, yes yeah, swati uh, thank you for your praising We yes arvind do we uh, we speak hindi you will see that what kind of hindi we speak all right um meam that's up to us meam will send <laughs> we'll meam meam will send uh, based on a lucky draw because let us touch 5 lakh subscribers so promote this channel if you feel we are doing good job only if okay don't just promote on uh, just randomly okay Uh, so guys if i have to share i think it will be a uh, perfect day to share yes, this Arvind, news yes everyone fine thank you We have reached. What happened? Do you rock? You are sad. Who? Do a rock is sad. Do a rock. <laughs> Do a rock is sad. How can yeah. it be possible? <laughs> so we have touched three lakh forty six thousand five hundred twenty six subscriber. Three lakh forty six thousand five hundred twenty six. All because of you guys. Thank so you so much. It can be a thank you note from us. Thank you for making it almost three and a half lakh. Thank and it's so been much. just six months. Awesome. Uh, Divya is asking about video. If you want to send your video, you have time till today evening till seven o'clock. You record yourself in your phone and just send us to learn with Sam and Ash at their gmail dot com. Simple website, uh, the same as the channel name. So Ed. we have a problem with some of the students about the size uploading the video on Gmail. Um, if you're getting size problem, then you can just upload it on your Dropbox and share the link with us. That also Google is possible. Yeah, Google Drive. Yeah. They can upload in Google Drive. You will see yourself on the channel forever and your story being there. So uh, you can do that. Uh, don't worry about that. We'll definitely do that. Yeah. I'm already saying um, invitation to twelve friends. There's a there's a Mosim. There's an error because you have written S as A I S H and it should be A I A S H. Mosim, there's a there's a spelling error. So somebody has already forwarded our channel to twelve people, <laughs> like a forward message. <laughs> That's good. Uh, there's a spelling mistake, Mosim, in the email ID. It should be A S H. Somebody is asking uh, Azuruddin about basic for beginners. 
for beginners we already have uploaded some videos on grammar secondly for beginners grammar shouldn't be a concern initially concern should be understanding english and also to speak with others whatever you have be resourceful i really like this prabhakar the sign it's really <laughs> cute yeah and thank you for prabhakar for being here uh, uh, prakar prakar no, prabhakar actually is prakar oh, okay oh we have a uh, uh, 100 rupees donation from uh, jafar mca Uh, Jaffa, thank you for hundred rupees donation. You guys are doing amazing service thank to the you community. Thank you so much. Um, see, this is what we believe in. This is what you believe in. Perfectly good. Um, so, the questions which are remaining, please write us in email IDs. Yeah, uh, how to get email uh, the PDF? Write us a mail on, on learn with Sam and Ash at their gmail dot com. Let me spell it here so that you don't get confused. Obligation, Krishna, is something that you are uh, obliged to, or it is compulsory to do. Obligation is something is that. uh learn with sam and ash okay let me just say learn with sam and ash ash is spelled as a s h learn with sam ash at the rate gmail.com simple so you have the channel's name you have the email id learn with sam and ash at the rate gmail.com i think you wrote in yeah that i have to change yeah thank you so much for the live session ashwarya thank you so much for, for being, being here for being the part of it So guys I think this is the time we have to say Yes Gaurav do you have any question Uh Sobhi Khan please ask your question quickly we are going to end it um Tomorrow what time class will start Hindi four. 11 English 4 pm These days sir and ma'am Uh Satyajit has a question mm -hmm. how are we spending busy, busy, busy with live classes and sometimes we just can't do anything because everything is closed sapna thakur goodbye to Hi, you hi swati i'm sorry for that we couldn't answer question a uh, big shout out to swati uh, for the angry swati you know <laughs> so <laughs> don't be angry swati tomorrow we'll answer your question we'll make a video on let surely. yeah we'll make a video on let yeah swati um so please if your question is not answered we'll definitely um um create a video on that preeti yadav is angry so guys believe um, me we are making notes of everything you are answering and we have almost suggestion for 50 videos exactly and they'll be on our channel some day just give us some time for that so be is angry we don't want anyone angry please ask your question by email id we'll definitely it's answer it's called as question. either either uh sanjay if i don't know why you're subs unsubscribing please <laughs> ask your question uh that's a threat directly to us please ask don't. your question it's not about that we are ignoring you we just trying to help any, <laughs> anyone and everyone we can why is melody so chocolate <laughs> we have no idea that that's not an english question oh, okay right? guys thank you so much um, so yes goodbye divya and goodbye to everyone as takur goodbye uh, ayush everyone. either it's called either 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 it's called either hi sobhi khan um we're getting many highs from sobhi khan Hi Rabia hi hi do rock i i hope you're not angry now uh, okay gorov your question is left literature that is going to be a first question tomorrow, tomorrow. exactly gorov a big shout out to you that could be going to be a first question tomorrow first question tomorrow. tomorrow be on time okay uh, ramana we are not ignoring you you said that we are doing great job thank you ramana we are not ignoring you we are not ignoring anyone literally okay so guys uh, let's go let's go let's go all right then i uh, will see you tomorrow then 4 o'clock for now have a good time and stay in home okay then bye bye have a good day goodbye swati goodbye everyone bye bye kanaya ponya